Hello. What's up, guys? Nikki, your host, is back from Nikki's Experience 04. Oh, look at that, the CP24 car. Very nice. I get to see a CP24 car in this video. So anyways, I'm here on Queen Street, just outside the Eden Center where the Hudson's Bay displays its window display every year. Unix programming. You know what we can do? I think the, the, this is the system that uh, delivers the the m letters to Santa. And right here, you got those bells. You know those ornaments that you hang on your tree. Okay, they're balls. Those uh, colorful balls. I think I zoomed in a little too much. Maybe I st shouldn't stand too close to the window. Just so that you guys can see it, can get a better view. So you see that? Everything's pretty nifty. But the problem here is this. Um, I came here 15 years ago. And I even came here like seven years ago. And they didn't have this kind of stuff. Instead, it was everything was all antique. Like they had the clock tower, the old school libraries you know those models where those animatronics the old school ones um i really miss those just for the sake of nostalgia i know i talked about this in many videos before but you know what i think they should do they should actually make a hybrid like of you know those modern uh, robotic animatronics like that like this one but also the old uh the old school stuff like, um, you know, if you watch my 2007 Christmas video at the very beginning, I was here and they didn't have all that. Everything was, everything was antique. So they should have a hybrid of this modern stuff and antique stuff too, like the antique window display. These are presents, the way the presents get delivered. I mean, it's all 21st century, right? So I can see why they would do that. I first noticed that in 2019, but I really wish they brought their old animatronics back. But anyways, I'm going to put a... I think they should do a hybrid, but you know what? Oh, look at that. There's a QR code. Scan for a magical virtual experience. Wow, that looks pretty cool. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going to put a link in the description for that uh, 2007 Christmas video. At the very beginning, that's where we walked along. We came here to Queen Street, looked at the window display, but it wasn't like this. So if you guys, you want to see it, um, it'll be in the description. I'll make sure I don't forget to post it. Look at those candy canes. But I mean, I still like this modern stuff. I just, uh, but still, I, I, I miss what I've seen. Because like I said many times, those, those modern Christmas stuff is not nostalgic. I like the old style of Christmas better. Look at that. Look how cute they are. The snowmen making snow angels. It looks kind of like real snow. Now, another thing I miss, I mean, of course they're playing music here, but another thing I miss is that um, when I came here, oh God, was it really that necessary for you to honk like that and interrupt me while I was talking? Of course the, the driver doesn't know, but still, it doesn't make it less annoying. But my, my point is this, when I came here 15 years ago, they were playing songs like Must Be Santa by Raffi. They were playing the Nutcracker March, you know, the March song. Then they played My Favorite Things by Julie Andrews. Like I went on Spotify to investigate and that song, My Favorite Things that they were playing here, it, it, was the, it sounded exactly like what it sounded in my 2007 Christmas video. I mean, that song came out in the 60s, but it's it's a good song. This is why every time I listen to it, it gives me the goosebumps. And now we've already reached the end. I'm pretty sure more when, I'm pretty sure the Christmas display would would uh, appear in those windows too. Like, 
all there is is just four windows like that 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 show the Christmas display. I'm pretty sure it didn't just stop there. And then I came here a late a year later uh, in 2008. And I, and I remember they were playing that song, My Favorite Things. Because when I heard it, when I heard them playing that song, I was thinking to myself, oh yeah, maybe they... Oh my freaking God. This is why I don't like to be in the middle of the city. This is why I like nature more than the streets of... More than the city streets. But like what I was saying is... I thought it was basically just an audio rec it was like I thought it was the exact same video that a, but it was just playing an audio at here at the speakers like you know first I thought it was just background music that appeared in that video I thought my mom used some kind of software to install the background music but no it was uh it was actually played here what Five. And my dad always told me mental health has become an epidem epidemic here in Toronto. So, uh, you know, that's what my dad meant. But you know what? I'm not going to waste time walking back and forth because you guys have seen enough. But I think what I'm going to do is now I'm going to head down to the subway. Actually, I got a drink in my hand right here. Uh... I got a drink from Starbucks. It's a peppermint hot chocolate. But uh, I got to find a subway station nearby. And also in that video, it shows me and my brother ru riding the escalator up and down. I'm pretty sure it's in that building right there. The, the, the building that says TTC right here. That's the sign I... I really hope I'm in the right place. Okay, I think it's right here. Oh wait, 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 that doesn't look right. God, I don't know what I just stepped on, but it really scared me. I know I stepped on something. That doesn't look right. That's not the entrance that, that I was, that appeared in the video. I think it was like just over there. But either way, I'll find the entrance. I hope it doesn't take all evening. Just kidding, I don't think it will, but uh, I better find it somewhere before, because I don't want to prolong my video. Okay, I think the entrance is like right here. I think this is it. Here, I'm gonna wave to open. I already got a drink in my hand. doesn't look right. Doesn't look the... What, what happened here? It doesn't look the same. Oh, you know what? I think I came in this entrance. Here, maybe I'll have to cross the street. I have to enter, I think I have to enter in through, through over there. I'm almost at 10 minutes long. Yeah, sorry if I'm annoying you guys by me walking back and forth, but uh, I still think it's worth it, right? Oh, two seconds left. I don't want to wait. Come on. I know I can make it in time. There we go. There's another Starbucks over there.
Okay, I think this is it. Yep, this is it right here. Ah. And we go. I love revolving doors. They're so cool. So yeah, this is where we ended up. Concourse and subway. Yeah, that, that sign hasn't changed. The sign that says concourse and subway. So yeah, this is just before it shows Christmas morning. That, that video basically just shows me and my brother going up and down the escalator here in this building. And I think my mom used this path network to get to uh, get to the underground parking lot. I know there's an underground parking lot somewhere around here. And like, I know my mom went to get the car. And I remember that part by mind. Like, I don't just remember it by video, but I, I can actually remember that. that Part. Okay, gotta open the door, but there's no button. Uh, here we go. Ah, God, why can't I open this stupid door? I wish they had a button. Here we go. Now we want, I want, yeah, so I'm actually standing at the right platform where the northbound trains are, so yeah. So I think this will conclude everything. So yeah, guys, you know what you do if you, if you enjoy this. And I'm about to head on the subway right now, so goodbye.